In this video, I'm going to deep dive into Mixing Network. Mixing Network is a layer one blockchain and it's actually in the top 10 blockchains by Total Value Locked on DeFi Llama, which means that there are many people using its apps on the DeFi side. And I wanted to understand why and what Mixing Network is. So basically, Mixing Network in one word is a proof of stake blockchain together with a messaging app. Uh, it's a little bit similar to Tom, the open network by Telegram, uh, in the sense that uh, there's a messaging app proof of, uh, plus a proof of stake blockchain, and there's a whole ecosystem of different applications that you can use for uh, lending, borrowing, swapping, uh, basically all the things you want to do in the DeFi ecosystem. So let's get uh, into, into the, the website itself, into the blockchain. Uh, you can see a bunch of statistics. Uh, you can connect basically mixing to a different uh, chains. Uh, they have 45 chains connected, uh, almost uh, 900, over 800 million transactions and still counting. Uh, the network itself has launched in 2018, by the end of 2018, I guess. Um, we, we'll get to that when we, we uh, look at the price. Uh, lighting speed, uh, different apps that you can get into and also open for developers to start developing different applications. Cool thing is that you can use MetaMask to connect to the applications and use mixing network. Um, so let's get into uh, the statistics first maybe. Uh, on DeFi Llama you can see this uh, list of different chains by the number of TVL locked, TVL meaning total value locked, how much money people are locking into various applications on the ecosystem. And you can see that mixing is on number 10, even before uh, Solana, which is 12. So if you go into mixing actually itself, uh, you will see there are 20, uh, 250 million dollars locked into mixing with the top applications being Bwatch 160 and Pando 92 million dollars. So those two applications are the core ones. Uh, Bwatch is basically uh, uh, and a, a protocol for uh, yield farming and Pando is a protocol for uh, swapping plus borrowing lending. So those are the two uh, crucial uh, DeFi services here on Mixin uh, that you can use and the most used right now. Uh, let's get more into what you can do with Mixin. So Mixin for developers is uh, allowing you to basically jump quickly into API and check a bunch of things. Uh, I actually got the most news from looking at the at the API because uh, there is not much information about the mixing itself. Uh, so the best thing you can do is go into AP reference and start going through uh, various things related to uh, what, what is mixing, what you can do with it. And basically you quickly see that it's a blockchain, uh, wall, blockchain plus instant messaging software. Uh, gives you access to their to their API, uh, which is really really uh, cool thing. So you can see a bunch of things uh, that also you can easily connect to other chains as well using the API from Mixin. Uh, so so this is pretty pretty interesting. They have their own token Xin that I will talk about in a moment. Uh, but let, first let's jump into different applications. So apart from the two main ones, Bwatch and Panda, uh, you have a bunch of other applications listed as well, uh, basically used to either uh, swap, so different DEXs, different DeFi uh, protocols, but also bridges, uh, shop to earn, uh, different apps that might be useful uh, on, on the web free journey. Uh, finally, there's the token, seen the token. Uh, there was a sale of that token that was happening in 2018. As you can see, uh, that the mixing itself was made in Tokyo, though some of the documentation is in Chinese. Uh, and uh, th this is also really interesting. And if you go into coin market cap, then basically you'll be able to see that. Uh, the, the price action here. So the top of the top was ba basically at the very beginning, 2018, January, and then the price got stabilized around 2019 with uh, this jump in 2021, last year, where everything was mooning. Uh, and basically we got back to 
uh, we got back to this price action, which is really, really stable. Uh, so this is it about mixing. This is the information that I have found so far. Uh, haven't used it myself. Uh, need to dig a little bit deeper to understand what's going on behind the, behind the chain. Uh, maybe worth looking at. Let me know what you think in the, in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more crypto news, crypto updates, and everything around DeFi, NFTs, and Web3.